is all about lipstick. It's 10 different lipstick hacks that I've learned over the years and I hope that they help you. Let's begin. Okay, hack number one is all about dry, chapped lips and you definitely don't want to apply lipstick to those. So what do you do? You can either use an expensive store-bought lip scrub or you can DIY one. Just take some sugar and Vaseline and mix it up in a bowl and then just scrub away. Go side to side, up and down, round and round and don't be gentle. After that, just wipe it all off with a tissue and now it's time to hydrate. So take some serum or some essential oils and just apply it on your lips. And then just wait a couple of minutes before you apply your lipstick for that flawless finish. For the next one, make sure you have a white pencil or a face pencil handy and just lightly apply it over your cupid's bow and then just blend it. Now apply your lipstick. This is going to make your lips look bigger and fuller. Who doesn't want that guys? I do. Now how do you keep your lipstick in place for hours and avoid smudging? Simple. Just take a tissue and some translucent powder. Make sure it's a thin layer of tissue, so just hold it in front of your lips and dust the powder over the tissue. This really works guys, it's gonna hold in the color for hours, no smudging and long lasting lipstick. What do you do when you want that light flush feathered look? It's really simple. You use your fingers to apply the lipstick. So just pat it on very lightly and voila! You guys want to see what happens when you apply the same lipstick directly? See the difference? Feel like your cheeks could use some color but you don't have a blush handy? Mm, don't worry. Now this is something our moms did for us in our school plays and performances and I'm not sure it worked then but it works now. Trust me if it's done correctly. So you can work with either a lighter shade or a darker one depending on the look you're trying to create. Just apply it onto your cheekbones and blend it with your fingers and ta-da! It's that simple. So the tissue powder hack doesn't really work well with liquid lipstick and man does that bleed. So what do we do? Basically after applying your lipstick just take a small brush, take some of your compact and just go all around the lip line. This is going to lock all that color in, no bleeding and long lasting lipstick again. Now this one is my favorite. I like to create unique shades that work for me that no one else has. How do you do that? You make three or four shades to create the perfect one. So here's one. Now let's see what happens when we add another one. Brighter and pinker, but let's try another one. Number three, perfect. So basically you just mix shades and experiment to create a look that no one else has and that's really new. Let's call this one the Sherry look. Now I really love to experiment with funky lipsticks, blue, green, grey, black, but you know I don't use them often and then you don't really want to spend so much on a lipstick that you're not using that much. So what do you do? You use eyeliners. So just apply some balm before you start because they're not as hydrating as lipsticks and then just apply the liner and keep adding colour until you're satisfied with the look and there you go. This is the perfect way to experiment if you want to just look fun and edgy for one night without spending a penny. Now smudged lipstick is a real pain. For an easy cleanup, just dip a Q-tip in some liquid makeup remover and hit that spot with precision. And then just cover the area up with some compact to get rid of any leftover color. Done. Perfect lips? Oh no, now how do we deal with this? After applying your lipstick, you're gonna do something disgusting and gross. You should just stick your finger in your mouth and suck on it. It looks really gross, I know guys, but really, really works. No more lipstick on your teeth ever, ever, ever again. So guys, if you found the video helpful, give it a thumbs up and also comment below with your lipstick hacks. And comment below if you guys want me to do more hack videos like fashion hacks, beauty hacks, more makeup hacks. And check out my last video here, subscribe here. See ya!